Hello, so how you can make circle insets on your model. So I have this model here and I want to create little circles maybe here or maybe on this side or maybe on this. So how to do this first? So we are going to make little circles here. I go in edit mode and this, this is the geometry. So how you can make circle in sets? First, you need to have enough geometry to create the circle. So here, I don't have enough geometry. I only have one face here. So I want to make three circles, one here, one here, and one here. So I need to create the geometry to be able to get the points and create the circle. So first, control R make loop cuts so here I want to have three different parts so I can scroll and put like this click escape so now I have three parts here I go in face select I have three parts here and now I also want more geometry on the other side here because this cannot create the shape of a circle Control R Put one, I can put one um, here. Escape. Now I go in vertex select and I have this point, this point, this point, this point. So these we can all move them. You have six and you can create a circle. For example, if I get this, I move it. I'm going to disable the subdivision surface. For example, I move this here. I get this, I move this here get this and all of this can create a circle but I'm not going to do this so we have the geometry to create the circle now we can get face select we can get this this um, and also we can maybe we can create another one so we have more and it's going to be better so one here escape control R one here escape Control R, one here, escape. Now we can get the face, face select, and this we're going to do I, do an inset, for example, like this. Now, on this one, we can make one, two, I, like this. This one, shift, click, select, I, like this. Now, these we want to transform into circle. So you need to go in edit preferences, go in add-ons and you, hit, you need to have the loop tools, mesh loop tools. Enable this and it is already in Blender. So enable this and now with the loop tools you will have, when you do right click on this, you have loop tools and you have all of this. So select the area you want to transform into a circle and we have enough geometry here. Right click loop tools and circle. Now you see it is a circle. You can do S to make this smaller, for example, like this. And also you see this little menu. If I undo, I undo, I do loop tools circle. When you click outside, this little menu is going to disappear. So here you can change everything. For example, the angle so you can rotate the circle. Uh, regular you can change all of this uh, flat uh, best fit or fit inside so it, it is directly inside like this you can change the influence of the circle I'm going to leave like this now we have our circle here and then I can I'm going to R rotate a little bit like this now we can do I again if you want, for example, to extrude inside them, then E, leave little um, edges to support this one, this edge here. So it's going to be sharp. Now, this, we can E, E again, do a little support I, like this. And now we have this. And when we put it back, the subdivision surface is going to be perfectly round here. It's going to be a circle. So you can do this 
for example this one select this right click circle put fit inside if you want to fit inside and now i can do i do a little inset e and i want to disable the subdivision so i can see and undo do again i e e e again i like this and now i put the subdivision like this but it is better to do the three at once so it is exactly the same um, distance now you can create circle insets on your mesh if you want to get my list of 60 and more websites to help you with 3d so you have website to get textures to get 3d models hdrs um, animations, sound effects, a lot of things, you can access my 3D resources. You have the link in the description. And also you can check out my different courses on my website. You have the link in um, here on the screen or the link in the description. And you can join the newsletter if you want to receive weekly discounts on all the courses. So I will see you in another video. Bye.